I begin tucking him into bed. He tells me, Daddy, check for monsters in my bed, please. I look underneath for his amusement. But then I see him. Another him. Under the bed. Staring back at me. Quivering and whispering. Daddy. There's somebody on my bed. One night at 3 in the morning. My wife wakes me up saying there's an intruder in her house. But... That's impossible. She's been dead for two years. I was watching funny videos on my phone. I stopped after my mother told me to go downstairs for dinner. As I was walking downstairs, my mother pulled me by the arm to the bathroom and told me, There's a good way to stay clear from monsters. You can look to your right, left, under your bed, even your closet, but never look up. She hates it when people stare at her. There's nothing like a laughter of a baby. Unless it's three in the morning. And you live alone. And that's a whole nother story. Three years ago, my son went missing. I remember going in so many search parties just to look for him. As I was losing hope, two officers knock on my door a big bright smile on their face saying how they found my son that he was just lost in the playground they gave me my son and they said their goodbyes but let me tell you this that is not my son he may look like him act like him and talk like him but that is not my son. I know that is not my son. I know because I buried my son in the woods after I killed him. <laughs>